In this video, I will present my paper fixed pattern noise removal for multi-view single sensor infrared camera. First fixed pattern noise or FPN is a temporally coherent noise present on videos due to the non-uniformities in the response of the imaging sensors. It degrades the quality of the observation and hinders subsequent applications. You can see on the left a noisy image that contains several noise, not only FPN, in the middle, an average image, photonic and electronical noise were removed, but FPN remains. On the right, the FPN was removed by our algorithm. This shows the effectiveness of our methods and the need to remove FPN. The following linear model is widely used for the FPN. Y equals a element Y's product X plus B, where Y is an observed noisy frame. X the clean frame we want to recover. In this paper we will consider that the noise is FPN is purely additive. Inside the FPN removal literature we consider the scene-based methods that seek to estimate the FPN from a single noisy sequence without additional external information. We can distinguish several subfamilies, optimization-based methods that define an energy with correction coefficients as variable that are minimized generally with a gradient descent, constant statistics methods that use image statistics and update correction coefficient recursively according to these image statistics, registration methods which use motion estimation between frames to obtain a reasonable estimate of the true scene to distinguish it from the noise. Another traditional subfamily of methods, temporal high-pass filter apply a simple spatial denoiser to each frame then do a running average of the residual, that is the estimation of the FPN. Inside this subfamily, we will compare our method with SLTHPF space low pass and temporal high pass non-uniformity correction algorithm and bilateral THPF new temporal high pass filter non-uniformity correction based on bilateral filter. There is also a more recent subfamily of methods, deep learning so learning based methods that use convolutional neural networks CNN to process a single noisy image we will compare our method with a more recent neural network method SNRWDNN wavelet deep neural network for stripe noise removal our contributions can be summarized as follows we introduce a generalized setting of the classical FPN removal problem where we assume an input sequences with T frames showing different realistic use cases for some particular cases of the problem, a new variational FPN or algorithm that can be used in different settings as explained above. We compare different optimization schemes both online and offline. For the standard single video FPN removal problem, the proposed rolling window method achieves state-of-the-art results. There are several use cases for our algorithm. Offline, several images are considered and the algorithm is iterated Online multi-view, camera with periodic movement, for each period an iteration of the algorithm is applied to the images obtained, and the FPN estimate is updated. Online rolling window, consider a given image window. Perform an iteration. Move the window by one image. Here are the R the energy that we want to minimize for each use case. We will detail the offline case in the next slides. We consider an images with the same FPN. We want to define a new variational FPN or algorithm based on an energy. Our starting point to define an energy will be the ROF model that uses total variation TV. TV is a regularization term widely used in image processing and computer vision. It is the norm of the, the discrete forward difference gradient. A naive extension of the ROF model to our multi-image case can be written as follows. Since we assume a common additive noise, we can rewrite it as following. So we have our energy. This convex energy minimizing problem can be solved by several ways. We will use the atom optimizer and the chain ball pock algorithm. Chain ball pock is a first order primal dual optimization algorithm for convex problems. Here is the pseudocode of the chain ball pock algorithm. Please refer to the paper and the supplementary material for more details. For the experiments, we used both synthetic data and real infrared data. For the noise, we consider both white noise and structured noise, column and row noise. 
For the offline setting, we compared our method with Atom and CP with the neural network SNRWDNN. Our methods achieve several dBs over SNRWDNN. Visual results are similar between CP and Atom. You can also look at the visual comparison between our methods and SNRWDNN. Our methods remove more noise and have less artifacts. For the online setting, we consider the PSNR of the last frames. Our methods achieve several dBs over both THPF methods for the multi-view setting. For the experiments on real infrared data, our methods remove more noise and have less artifacts. So our methods works not only on synthetic data but also on real data. Here, once again, our methods achieve several dBs over both THPF methods for the traditional single video setting in a dozens of iterations. Our methods perform better than a neural network. THPF methods require 100 iterations to do so. For future research, we plan to extend this algorithm to gain an offset FPN and to try to apply neural network for multi-view FPN removal. Thanks for your attention.